This past year, my nephew and I made a goal to watch all the Godzilla movies. My nephew is a huge fan and has even named his crested gecko after the famous monster. On our quest to complete the kaiju franchise, we soon realized there is no other beast in comparison when it comes to storytelling. Most people think of Godzilla as a giant creature that destroys cities, especially if you're only familiar with the films produced in America. But in Japanese culture, where the idea of Godzilla was created, he is used as a metaphor for the dangers of man's tampering with science. A metaphor that is sadly still relevant 70 years later as it pertains to the threats of nuclear warfare. Tamayoki Tanaka was inspired to create Godzilla from the misfortune of the Lucky Dragon, an event that started an uprising of anti-nuclear clamor. The Lucky Dragon was a fishing boat that unknowingly came too close to testing sites located off the Marshall Islands, a place where the U.S. continued to test and develop nuclear weapons years after the bombings of Hiroshima and Nagasaki. While innocent fishermen were trying to make a living, the U.S. was preparing its most powerful bomb yet, a 15 megaton hydrogen bomb that would have 1,000 times the explosive power that flattened Hiroshima. The 23-man fishing boat was 85 miles east of the blast when they saw night turn to day instantaneously. After the crewmen were rocked by an invisible concussion, they knew they had just witnessed the aftermath of an atomic explosion. As the boat made its way home, it was showered with white radioactive ash. The men became sick with nausea, headaches, severe eye problems, and many of them would eventually die. When they finally arrived, what followed was public outcry, formation of anti-nuclear activist groups, and a campaign to ban the bomb. Food markets that rely on the sea had radiation poisoning permeating its way through the people. Many saw this as a third attack from nuclear use. In the midst of this devastation, Tamayoki Tanaka was compelled to tell a story that could capture an audience and deliver a message. The dark allegory of Godzilla displays the trauma and anxieties that Japan faced during America's use of nuclear weapons. A country that has experienced defeat unlike any other nation has combined their catastrophic history with the image of a fear-mongering dinosaur to produce the greatest monster film to ever exist.